Tearing down my studio, trying to get ready for the trip. <laughs> so I got through. <laughs> so what's the dinner of champions? A little Powerade. We got some ham sandwiches. <laughs> and some sun chips. For only $14, you could have it too. with my patrons so much information is he there oh he's right over there oh man oh, i know what they thinking and welcome back this is your man warrior and i am at work i've been busy i've got new content coming out soon i can't disclose when but soon and i just couldn't leave you guys hanging wanted to have some fun i was in arena did my climb and then i had this guy fall and nil hit me and he knocked me out and i actually attacked him twice and lost twice and so i figured i was going to fight fire with fire i have not yet ran my zeta emperor palpatine i am having troubles trying to find enough good quality mods to actually catch up to to his mods i think i've matched his speeds so now it's going to be the exact same team with the exact same team and i just wanted to have a little saturday night arena fun who knows if i'm going to win or not i just want to see this new team i know a lot of people that are running it i tried with sith trooper and lost so we're going to go ahead and go in with general kenobi i know sith trooper is actually a really really good sith tank and um you know i think that sith trooper is possibly future meta but um with this particular team composition it wasn't thrawn's also in there because of the cleanse and the fracture and then of course the top three are just amazing so we're gonna go ahead and go in with basically the exact same team that he has and i've matched his speeds almost to the the penny i think our darth vaders are the exact same speed so i'm curious as to see who the rng will pick to go first and i think whoever goes first is going to end up winning but let's go ahead and battle it out and the rng picked his team to go first so i'll get to go and i landed more debuffs yay so i get to throw my calling blade um let's uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and ability block General Kenobi. And they fracture my tank. 
I'll fracture their tank. This is going to, like I said, be kind of a mirror match. I'm going to try and stun. Hopefully, I get their Emperor Palpatine and Darth Nihilus stunned. Ouch. Let's go ahead and... Hmm. Let's try and... Let's continue. Let's ability block their Darth Nihilus. Why not? And let's go back and ability block their Emperor Palpatine. Let's increase cooldowns. Let's go ahead and get him out of here. He won't be able to heal now. Well, he'll be dead now. Now we need to finish off Darth Nihilus. Actually should have targeted Thrawn with that. Could have taken his offense up. Now this is why he's in here. He's for the cleanse. We're going to go ahead and cleanse General Kenobi since he's a taunting tank. We need him to have that debuff gone and he can cleanse now. Now it's going to go downhill for their team. Because obviously their Emperor Palpatine was their everything. Ouch. He's done. Let's go ahead and get rid of Darth Nihilus. And what's really cool is he had, we have the same speed Darth Vader, but RNG picked him to go first, yet I was able to still pull off a victory with all of my health and almost half my protection on the characters. So pretty cool. I'm glad I got that victory. Um, not sure what I think of this team yet. I think that uh, the, Imp the Empire and the Sith, I think they have a future in the meta, but I'm just having a little bit of fun on Saturday night. Let's try another battle. All right, Gargamel to the right is the current meta with Rey, BB-8, R2-D2. Let's go ahead and fight that team with this exact same team. All right, our BB-8 and R2 and all that's way faster than what I have, so of course gets to go first. Um, I mean, I think I have like a 238 speed Darth Vader, even with his like almost 60, 56 speed bonus or something like that for what I've got crossed the way in with here. I'm still slower than their BB-8 combo, kind of crazy. Let's ability block General Kenobi. Let's go ahead and fracture their General Kenobi. Go ahead and try and get some stuns. Let's increase cooldowns. That's significant. I tell you, Darth Nihilus had a huge place, and now Darth Nihilus has a, a, a pretty big spot. Um, hmm. Hate the foresight. Let's get rid of it. Let's get rid of that potency up buff. Slows the team down a little bit. Try an ability block. Now I really want to kill their Thrawn since he's going to keep my character out of commission. Whap! This should kill him. Or not. <laughs> That'll get him. Alright. Got to do it before they get secret intel spread too far because they're going to go crazy as soon as they get their buffs um let's kill general kenobi because he was taunting let's ability block and let's go ahead and get rid of that secret intel off let's try and kill r2d2 38 000, that's not bad shocks honor shocks a really great debuff as well let's try and increase the cooldowns Get some stun on, drop down the debuffs, and this is looking pretty decent so far. Bam! And that's all she wrote. So there's two for two. This is a pretty legit team. I know a lot of people run it. Uh, this is literally the first day I decided to run it on my personal account. Uh, again, I I kind of I had a defeatist attitude. I had a few people that embraced it immediately, and their their mods were. I mean, one of them's. Darth Vader has 140 plus speed um, and is like 156 speed uh, and the whole team gets to go before mine and when you run the same team against the same team you just lose so I figured I'm not going to do that I'll keep doing my Jedi Ray but I figured I would try we've got a lot of new fun Sith content coming out everybody knows that with the new Sith raid that's about to happen so I figured I would try to embrace the dark side a little 
Maybe there's hope for me. As always, if you have comments, leave them down below and keep your gaming on. Warrior, out.